setting toe. You do this on the ground. You do not do it up in the air. I'm doing it up in the air just to give you an idea of how to do it. So you want to pick a spot on each tire, a tread. I always use the outer tread right here. I'm using this spot right here, here and on the back side. And I'll go to the other side and I'll grab the same tread spot here and on the back side. Okay. Okay. I marked it just so I get you an idea. So now you want to get yourself a good tape measure, put it in there where the mark is and go all the way over to the other side. You want to read it. Uh, I'm going to go 63 and 5 sixteenths. Okay. 63 and 5 sixteenths. Now I'm going to go to the rear. See my mark? It's on the same tread, but on the back side. Uh, see right here. I'm going to go 64. Okay. So the back measured 64, the front measured 63 and 5 sixteenths. So five from 16 is 11. So I have 11 sixteenths towed in. Should be like an eighth of an inch towed in. So what you wanna do on this one, you want to loosen your jam nut on your tie rods I'll show you those. Right here's your jam nut. And right here's a jam nut. Okay, loosen those up just a little bit. You can thread them out a couple, maybe one, two turns. Now we're towed in. So that means we wanna bring the front tires out and the back of the tire in. So we want to make the tire go out, which means we want to bring the tie rod ends in. So what we'll do is we'll turn the tie rod ends in a half a turn on each side. Do your adjustments equal. Mark your tie rod so when you turn it, you'll be able to know where it was and you're at. I marked it with white paint. So what you want to do is you want to thread this in to the tie rod so this white mark is in the front. You want to thread it in. And by threading it in, that brings this tire closer to you and brings the front out, okay? And you do the same thing over here. You mark it and you wanna turn thread this in till it's on the other side equally. So that way you know that you adjusted it equally, okay? So if it was just the other way around, then you would do the adjustments just the opposite. Hopefully you get the idea of threading them in brings the front out. And by threading them out, brings the front in, okay? So now you're driving down the road and your steering wheel is off to the all right, like that, it's off to the right. So if it's off to the right, that means you wanna turn your wheels to the right with your tie rod ends. And when you do that, if it's off to the right, you wanna turn your tie rod, you wanna thread it out. I'm going to thread the tie rod in, I mean, so the tire goes out. If it's off to the right, 
thread the right tire in so the tire goes out. And on the left tire, you want to thread it out and it brings it more in, okay? Because when it's off to the right, your tires are like, see, 63 and a half. Now we'll go measure the backside. And what do we got? 63 and a half. Perfect. Hopefully you get the idea. If the <clears throat> rear was smaller than the front, then you want to bring the, make the back smaller. So that means you'll need to shorten your tie rod ends, okay? Now, if you're driving down the road and your steering wheel is off to the right, so when you're driving down the road and you straighten the wheel, the car pulls to the left because you're basically your tires are pointing to the left. So what you need to do is, if, if the steering wheel is off to the right when you're driving, you need to turn your wheels to the right with your tie rod and adjustments. Thread them in or out exactly the same on both sides. If it's if the wheel's off to the right, the wheel's off to the right, you want to bring your right front tire to the right. You want to make it go out. And the left front tire, you want to make it go to the right, but you want to make it go in. So make sure you do those adjustments equally. Don't go bananas. Sometimes a lot makes a lot of difference. So, your wheels off to the right. You want your wheels to go to the right with your adjustment. Okay. After you make your adjustment and redrive it, the wheels, steering wheels should be straight, and the wheels straight. If your steering wheel is off to the right, turn your steering wheel center. Then the car will go to the left. So that means you need to bring your tires to the right on your adjustments. If you're driving down the road and your steering wheel is off to the left, so you straighten your wheel, the car goes to the right. So that means you gotta turn your adjustments to make the left front go to the left and the right front go to the left. When you make them adjustments, you do them equally. So that's equal adjustment so you don't throw off your toe. So after you get them going, the vehicle going straight, which is steering wheel straight, then you can go and recheck your toe. You know, your measurement on the front tread, tire to tire, and the back tread, tire to tire, should be a 16th to an eighth of an inch difference, preferably towed in, okay? Hopefully, you understand that. It's hard to understand, especially with the steering wheel off center and you turn the wheel to the direction that the steering wheel is off centered. But wheels off, goes, if the steering wheel is off to the right, turn your wheels to the right. Make sure you do that adjustment equally. Okay. And make sure you do all these measurements on the ground, not up in the air on the ground. I was just showing you up in the air easier. You might want to use a four by four block of wood to help hold your tape against the tire. Okay.